Okay, I just entered the house, so just to give you a reference, here is the front door. There is a glass um, storm door, solid wood door with a little light panel there. And right off the entryway is your half bath with some beadboard detailing, built-in shelving, laminate countertops, and this is all tile that comes in from the entryway. So just a great half bath, nice vaulted ceilings throughout this great room here. So tile onto laminate floor, and then down the hall, down the stairs is carpet to tile out to the garage. So we'll head down there in a minute. But here is your family room. Um, either electric or gas rain, uh, fireplace insert. I'm assuming it is gas based on what it looks like. And of course, I've chose this lovely, lovely day to really take in all those views. As you know, it's out there, but you can't probably see it in a video. Now, there are trees directly across the road, and you don't own those, so I don't know if you get the HOA to let you share those up. You do have expansive ocean views, those distance ocean views heading a little to the north that probably, well, those lots across the street did sell. I think one of them's buildable, so you could have someone eventually on that side, just to let you know. So back into the house here. So we've got a nice, decent sized family room um, with that fireplace and windows. And then your eating area with a bar, with an overhang. You could probably fit four bar stools there. There is a ceiling fan here um, above the dining room table, and this is all carpet through this area. And the carpet's in nice shape. And then there is a coat closet. I walked right by it. Coat closet there, so that would be your entryway coat closet. And then the laundry room. It's a nice size laundry room. Washer dryer, built-in cabinets, window looking out towards the parking spot and then they have a couple extra cabinets in here as well and that is um let me see that is linoleum or vinyl and then into the kitchen we've got real tile floors in here it's funny how you have to like feel them to see and then they have a breakfast nook so breakfast nook here oak cabinetry granite countertops, stainless steel matching whirlpool um, appliances. And then this really beautiful big window overlooking with those ocean views, dual stainless steel undermount sink, and then that granite countertop wraps all the way around. So I'm gonna step back to kind of give you a good overview of the entire kitchen area. There you go. Okay, so on this floor, so from the garage up to this floor, I think is five stairs. And on this floor, besides the living room, dining room, kitchen, breakfast, and a laundry room, half bath, there is the master suite. So you wouldn't have to go upstairs other than from the garage up to this floor. You could really live on this floor for just the two of you. Decent sized room, nothing huge, a little um, narrow and long, but definitely, I mean, he's got a desk in here, chair, that's a queen size bed, end tables, decent sized dresser here. There is a nice skylight, so this room is, has some great natural light, and then that one large window that is west facing. So from your bed, let me get on the other side of the bed. From your bed, if you put your bed where his is, or hers, you do have some ocean views going that way. Now, once again, directly across the street is another lot. I That's not a buildable lot as far as I know. Um, it is actually landscape, so I'm assuming it belongs to that house right there. Now, those big trees, once again, we could talk to the HOA about trimming those up for improve your view. And then... Um, into the master bath, which has um, linoleum flooring, dual sinks with laminate countertops, tiles, giant um, jetted, 
tub. Nice skylight in here. Nice tall ceilings throughout this entire house on this floor. And then in here is the toilet and a step-in fiberglass surround tub um, shower. And it does have a bench. And then also in this room is a decent size walk-in closet. So you got rods, built-in folding or shoe, and then it wraps around here. Nice use of space throughout. Um, the carpet maybe isn't as great as I initially thought. I, now that I'm looking more at it, there's definitely, yeah, okay. First glance, I thought the carpet was good. They obviously had a dog because we see um, signs of maybe some little chewing on some corners. So definitely this whole house could use a good painting. Okay, so here we go. Down those stairs, I told you, yep, five of them. And then this is back to tile here and into the garage. This is an oversized two car garage. It's fully finished. There is attic access. There's your furnace, your hot water heater that is double strapped. And then this little bonus area over here, like a little shop area. And there's that door that I thought you could use to let the dogs out if you, um, out to that little extra area. So maybe this could be a good area for the dogs here. Um, because there's that area right there out that door that I was talking to you about. Okay, and then down this, down the final flight of stairs, they do have a chairlift here, so you could keep that or you could get rid of it. Makes the stairs slightly narrow. Um, back to different kind of wood laminate flooring throughout down here. This is not real wood. I will feel and make sure. Oh, hmm. No, it's not real wood. I'd like to say it is, but it's not. Um, good size bonus extra room. Two closets. Interesting wall detail there. Nice size window overlooking the patio. Here is the patio I showed you in the outside video. This will give you a better look of it. Facing due west, you will have some beautiful sunsets here just like you would in that other house. But a nice covered patio, built-in lights, recessed lighting. But yeah, this is the little bit of yard that you have on this level. And then here's the full bath for downstairs. Tile flooring, vanity with a solid surface, probably Corian top, very reminiscent of the time this house was built and then a tub and shower surround. You know, as I said, this house could use a good painting on the inside. We've got some dings and some stains. Um, there is an extra linen closet here, which is nice outside of your extra bath. And then they're using this as a den, but this is definitely a bedroom. Two good size windows facing due west. Once again, some interesting detailing there with the ledge all the way around, and then there's a closet. I think that just about wraps it up. Um, we are at 3654 Ocean View Drive in Florence, three bedrooms, two and a half baths, 1,989 square feet, came on the market just two days ago for $589,900.